appreciate being brought in to study the valley. I wish the military's presence here wasn't so domineering. I can't say these giant structures add much to the view. It would be nice if this was simply a place of study and conservation. I'm doing my best to steer the army away from the ruins, but the only thing that seems to concern them is their project. Gathering up as many of these strange orbs as they possibly can. September 17th, 1942. My name is Andrew Fisher, leading physicist and head of Project Pendulum. Pendulum is the research and development project directed by the Army Corps of Engineers to produce a weapon of mass destruction that can bring an end to the war through the unconditional surrender of our enemies. In response to the spy-ridden efforts of the Manhattan Project, headed by my cohort, Robert Oppenheimer, Pendulum has been founded under the utmost secrecy. Funds, pride, and soldiers' lives are all on the line in a race to win the war, thus giving rise to the name Pendulum.
and Soviet espionage. Pendulum's location and purpose is unknown to the outside world. Taking a cue from the Manhattan Project, only a small few know of Pendulum's purpose, operating under the guise of an alternative energy project. As it came to light that Manhattan had been plagued with espionage, it was agreed upon to shroud Pendulum within the government itself. All those who knew of Pendulum's true intent are here. Though admittedly extreme, we can ensure an ironclad umbrella of secrecy. Information can only come in, and none can go out. As far as anyone outside this valley knows, Pendulum does not exist. This valley does not exist.
Schrodinger's cat. This is beyond my wildest imagination. As a result of the reaction between the Amrita energy and the Pathfinder's own life force, they experience what I have dubbed quantum death. When a Pathfinder dies while wearing the suit, their consciousness branches into a new reality, unharmed. They achieve quantum immortality. 